from IMK Technical Hub and in this video I will show you that how you can restore your AMD graphic cards to the factory settings as if you are getting some error messages and want and if you want to restore the graphic cards to the factory settings then this is the right place so keep watching this video completely also this will help if you are getting error messages in your graphic cards so keep watching this video completely so let's get started so first of all what you have to do you have to go to your google chrome browser and if you are using any browser you have to go to that browser and in the tab you have to type amd and click enter and then you can see the first page welcome to amd processor click on this So now the page is loading. Then you have to click to drivers and support. And here what you have to do, you have to select your type of graphic card which you are using. If you are using notebook graphics, click on this and if you are using some different options, so you can check, check it out. I'm using on laptop notebook graphics and then you have to find which graphic card you are using and if you want to know what you have to do you, you have to go to this window option and here you have to right click and choose device manager and then you have to go to display adapter settings and click on this arrow and you can see which graphic card you have you can see amd radeon hd 8670m series so here you have to select Radeon HD series and you, your product 8600M series and then this is the case which you have to select which windows you are getting when you have purchased your laptop. If you have purchased your laptop at uh, window 8 and now you have updated your laptop to window 10 or window 8.1 then you have to select window 8. And if you have uh, purchased a laptop and your laptop has been installed with Windows 7, so click on this. As I have purchased this laptop and now I am using Windows 10. So if you if I want to restore the graphic card to the factory setting, then I have to select to Windows 8 64 bit. So click on this and click here display results. So now it will display results which, uh, which when I have purchased this laptop that graphic card is installed in my laptop so you can see the release date 25 april and 2014 and now this is 2017 if i select uh, uh, on the previous option window 10 then i i will get amd crimson update so you can see the amd mobility radeon driver and file size is 260 mb and release date is 25 april 2014 and if you are getting some error messages in your graphic card and if you have updated your laptop to the latest latest graphic card and also you can see one video here on my channel that how to fix no MD graphic card driver installed and if if uh, by seeing this video and if you are unable to solve the problem of graphic card in your laptop so then you have to install the factory inbuilt graphic card drivers to your laptop and i will show i will sh uh, i will i will show you um, i will uh, i will already tell you that how you can install the drivers to the factory conditions and and the most important part is that you have to know which windows you have installed if you have installed windows 7 or windows 8 then click on on here i will again win radeon hd series and 8600 m series and most important part i will tell uh, i will already tell you that you have to select which windows when you purchase your laptop that uh, your system uh, comes with that window 8 comes or windows 764 bit you have to select that option and not not now which you are using if i i am i am on windows 10 64 bit if i click on display results then it will me it will show me a uh, options of radeon software and adrenaline edition this is new edition which uh, has been updated so if you want to 
install the factory settings then you have to select read your sd series 80 600 m series and window 8 64 bit and click here display results and here you, what you have to do you have to download this file click start download and wait for the setup to be completed and then what you have to do you have to run this program and and every problem of your graphic card error messages any problem to your graphic card will be solved by restoring the graphic card drivers to the factory conditions i hope this video is useful if you find this video useful please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and also if you have any doubt you can ask questions in the comment section so thank you